Buenos dias, mis amigos. Soy Vic Grace, and welcome back to another video. After years of anticipation, the moment has finally arrived. Dragon Ball Sparking Zero is here. We've waited patiently, dreaming about what this game would deliver, and now it's time to experience the epic battles, jaw-dropping transformations, and intense action that we've longed for. From reliving iconic moments to diving into fresh content, the hype is real, and the wait has been worth it. Now, I'm about to jump in, power up, and unleash everything I got. This is going to be legendary. Let's play. All right. Let's go episode battle. We're going to do, um, I guess, some PvE for now. Um, I still have to... to. I guess I want to figure out a little more about the game before I do any PvP. But I, I definitely will be doing some PvP later on throughout this channel. But I hope you guys enjoy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and get you this started. Us, Kakarot. Think of the battles you'll have. Is it your enough? Saiyan blood boiling with excitement from the thought? Shut up! If you think I'd ever join you, then you're dumber than you look. Damn, Goku, tell him. All right, let's let's do this. Let's do this. I can't help but wonder. That child behind you is that your son? He, he's not. Talk about it. Talk about it. That boy indeed has Saiyan blood. Where's he going, bro? No use you can't go anywhere, Raditz. I can see his tail from here. Oh, very nice, very nice. So what if he does? You know, perhaps you need a little time to decide. I'll just borrow your son for a while so you yeah. can think over my offer. Take one step closer to Gohan and I'll knock you out. Back off. Stay away. Stay away. Get down, fool. We're settling this right here and now. You missed. We're under the sea, fool. Oh, I'm very nice. Oh, that was easy. Right in the butt. Right in the butt. Kicked him right in the booty. All right. If you want your little brat, return safely, Kakarot. Prove your Saiyan spirit. Eliminate 100 Earthlings and pile them here before I return in one day. And Tom let Rats. me be very clear about this. If I come back and I don't see 100 corpses, I kill the kid. Oh, that's huge. Go, go on! Dang it, Krillin. No, I'm just kidding. Goku is no match for Raditz. Overwhelming strength, and Raditz successfully kidnaps Gohan, however. He is then treated to an unexpected reunion. Piccolo? Piccolo? But what are you doing here? I was pursuing him. And as much as I'd like to kill the wretch myself, the sad truth is I have a better shot at that. If you were along for the ride. Hold on, you mean team up with me? Why in the world would you ever do that? Don't get the wrong idea. This would just be a temporary alliance, only for the sake of eradicating that alien off my planet. Once that purpose has been served, I'll keep my promise to crush you. And then I can get back to my plans of world domination. Dang. Not that I'm going alone. I'm going alone. <laughs> going alone. Goku, watch yourself and keep calm. We all know you can do this. Let me come with you. The three of us together could whip that guy easy. Sorry, Krillin, but you've already been brought back to life by Shenron once before. If anything were to happen to you now, you'd be gone for good. Maybe mm -hmm. so, but don't let yourself get Master Roshi's right. Let us back you up if you need it. Krillin, Master Roshi, you're the best. All right, let's do this. We better head out. Bulma. Got the Dragon Raider all working? You bet. I should have realized that was the four-star Dragon Ball on Gohan's hat. All right. It's all or nothing now. Goku, wait! Bulma, let's follow them. Say what? 
Let's do this. Let's go. I mean, Master Roshi has O3 instinct, right? So it'd be easy. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Goku declines Piccolo's invite and takes Gohan back with Krillin and Master Roshi. Master Roshi boards the aircraft with Bulma. Goku and the others go ahead to find Raditz. They have they had intended to launch a surprise attack, but they are detected by Raditz Scouter. They abandon their plan and decide to face him head on. Oh, Kakarot. I thought you'd at least be smarter than this. But you have no idea how out of your league you are. You know, believe it or not, battles aren't just about raw strength. That's right, Super's talk is about technique. We'll see how long your strategicness keeps you alive. I'm sorry, brother. I was thinking about my offer and I've changed my mind. You'd probably just slow the rest of us down. And for betraying the Saiyan race, you will die! <laughs> no, I won't. I'm a real human. My name's Goku. Oh shoot! Oh anyway. Let me share a little something with you. That's right, you ain't nothing. Interesting. Watch this. You could train yourself for a lifetime and never even come close to that level. But since yeah. you're too stupid to heed my warning, oh, very, very you're going to survive another day anyhow. Yeah. Get up, Goku. Oh, he got me first. Im impossible. Take this, rats. Mm. Stay. Oh, frick. You do so much damage, dude. We're settling this, We're settling this right now. I missed. What was that? That was interesting. Take this. Yeah. Yeah. How about this? Uh, oh. You won't beat me. Worthless device. Okay, I don't know what what to do right there. I've never seen that before. <laughs> what do you do? Okay, so you spam it. Got it. Huh. Considering how you managed to beat me last time, <sighs> I'm gonna see if you've gotten any tougher. I'm ready. So don't you disappoint me. Got it, Goku. Pickle. I'll show you true power. Take this. Ah, me. You've got a new special attack hidden up your sleeve. Now's the time to use it, Goku. What's Piccolo doing here? Sorry. Dude. Nope. <laughs> Lazy fool. That's because you shouldn't be able to block. Get up, get up, get up, Goku. A sure kill technique. So you've been developing a new technique too? And just when I thought I might have closed the gap between us. Wait, you got a new move too? Why? What the? Power level 1307? That's right. Oh. So you sure what happened? Okay. Leave him alone! Leave my daddy alone! You, you little brat. <laughs> Please let this work! Oh shoot, no way! No! Idiots. That's not gonna be lightning ship. Oh shoot, he got him! Master Roshi! Now Piccolo! End it! Special beam cannon! How could I have been beaten by such a small fry? Huh. Goku and his friends work together to beat Raditz. However, he warns them in one year's time, two even stronger Saiyans will visit Earth. Goku contacts his friends, and they start a strict training regimen under the watchful eyes of Kami. However, having not been trained in martial arts before, Gohan cannot keep up with them. 
He tries his best to follow their lead and train, but he knows that he will only hold them back. Then Piccolo arrives. Piccolo points out that they have been too kind to go on their training. He informs them he will take over Gohan's training. Okay, I'll leave Gohan's training to you. Goku, are you nuts? I know. The old Piccolo was once our greatest enemy, but this one? After what happened today, I think we can trust him. Know what I mean? He's right. If it wasn't for Piccolo, we'd all be dead. And we've got a mutual enemy, so we could use all the help we can get. Gohan, what do you want to do? Piccolo is an amazing fighter, and if you ask me, I think he might actually be a good guy. Well, I... I want to be strong like you, Dad. So I'll do it. I'll learn how to fight with Mr. Piccolo. Well, if you're that eager, then there's no time like the present. Teach him everything you know, Piccolo. No way. Goku and the others complete their training with Kami and each other. So when Kami and each of them then continue to work on their individual skills, they then gather the test, the fruits of their labor. You guys have been training hard, huh? You bet. Gotta do our best to catch up with you. I finally finished developing that technique I was teasing before. Can't wait to show you. We're treating today's training as serious as the real battle to come. And we'll showcase all we've learned in preparation. How should we proceed, Goku? No way. This is awesome. Okay, who do we want to fight first? So first of all, guys, I think I'm not going to talk as much just because this is definitely new. I'm going to let you guys hear all the the cutscenes. Um, no, let's let's start with let's start with Krillin. Krillin, you want to train with me? You bet. Now you won't have to wait to see my new moves. <laughs> just like old time. Let's do this. All right, Krillin. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good, Krillin. Yeah. We're settling this right here and now. Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna learn how to play the game a little better. Let's see. I'm over here. Oh, very good dodge. Good dodge. So you can't break them out of their attacks whenever you. Very nice. Very nice. Get up, Goku. I missed that. <laughs> Take this. Solar flare. Solar flare. Oh freak. So that's what it looks like. Krillin. There you go, finally got him. Good job, Krillin. Oh yeah, let's go. Oh, man, just when I thought I might have been on the same level as you. Back to the drawing board. Krillin, you're really good. Don't beat yourself up, man. Don't beat yourself up. Do we gotta fight all of them? No, okay. Goku and the others have tested their power. They return to their training in, pre in preparation for the Saiyans attack. However, they do not have enough time before Saiyans appear, appear on Earth. The Saiyans send multiple Saiyans to test Goku and his friends. With the benefit of their strict training, they easily see them off threat. Finally, a Saiyan called Nappa decides to confront them directly. Alright, Nappa. I'll be killing Kakarot first. No, 
Don't get I... cocky because you defeated Raditz. I'm twice as powerful as that rat. Yeah. All right. I wonder because like Goku doesn't have Kyle Ken, so he's still base Goku, which doesn't matter. I'm too powerful. Ugh. You think you're so strong? I'll do this again. Okay, good dodge, good dodge. You think you're tough? You think you're tough? Do you know I can do this stuff? I'm right here, Napa. I'm. Oh, good job, good job, good job. Just get here. You're not, you're not strong enough. I'll show you my true technique. Oh shoot. I'm behind you, idiot. Yeah. One, two. Oh, good, good block. Oh, good job. Oh, frick. Get down there. Oh, very nice. Him with the Kamehameha Mahamahama wave. I'll show you my true power. <laughs> what? Impressive. Vegeta. Help me. I have no use for a paralyzed Saiyan. Crazy. Get new outfits. Get new outfits. Items added to the shop. Very epic. Vegeta, why? Vegeta kills Nappa without battling. Batting an eye at his... As the later has lost to Goku. Goku and the others can sense Vegeta's overwhelming power. They divide into two groups. Along with Goku, Tien and Piccolo, who both have strength left to spare, engage in combat with Vegeta. Goku, sorry, Gohan, Krillin, Yamcha, and Chaozu leave the battlefield. Once Gohan and the others have left, the remaining three begin their battle with Vegeta. Why would you kill your own partner? <laughs> Because I wouldn't be caught dead associating with someone who would be taken down by such low-class warriors. You really get on my nerves. You ought to show some more respect to others than that. Respect? Huh. You're a poor excuse for a Saiyan. All right, Vegeta. I don't even know K.O. Ken. Oh, you have some power, I see. And the Mechian people are said to have mysterious hidden abilities. Magical ones, in fact. I see. You must have been the one who created these dragon balls, aren't you? You think you're so tough? What would you like to know? Get on your way, Vegeta. Mm. No, get up there. Get up there, yeah. Stay there, stay there. I'll show you what it's like to be a real Saiyan. Frick. Ow, 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 ow. You're gonna pay for this. Take this, Vegeta. Ah. Um, Slick, you ain't nothing. You ain't nothing. Oh, frick, I missed. Here it goes! Oh, very nice. Mm, I miss. Aha. Frick. He's stronger than you. Then he looks, guys. He's short, but he's strong. He's short, but he's strong. Yes! Easy. Stay down, Vegeta. 
I'm the Prince of Saiyans. How can he hurt me? Yeah. Easy. And Jin Han. Hi. He gets angry. Vegeta has been injured by Goku. Enraged, he transforms into Great Ape in the attempt to defeat Goku. However, Piccolo had destroyed the moon during his testing with Gohan to combat Gohan's Great Ape transformation. V Vegeta realizes the moon isn't there. Instead, he creates a power ball to transform into a Great Ape. Three of them share the remaining sense of beings between them to face Vegeta's Great Ape form. What are you doing? Impressive. Ow. Ow. <sighs> Chill with all the energy beams, son. Am I losing my mind? He turned into a giant monkey. This is crazy. How do I fight this thing? Damn it. Yeah, just take that. Hold that. No one turned into one of these hulking things, but this is a hundred times worse. I finally figured it out. The monster that stomped my grandpa Gohan Ow. to death. Ow. Smashed up the tournament arena all Get up, Goku. Ago. That, that was me, oh, freak. wasn't it? I might as well let you know. The power level of a Saiyan when they transformed into a grade 8 is 10 times their normal strength. <laughs> impressive. Impressive, Vegeta. Impressive. I'll vaporize you. Oh, Goku. What? Ow. I didn't dodge. Ooh, knocked down. Come over here. Curse you. Oh, I can, though. Ooh, you... what do you think of that? Now watch. He's so dumb. Ow, just kidding. Don't give up, Goku. It might look hopeless, but we've survived this far. Krillin? Not just me, bud. Yamcha, uh, Gohan. Jutsu, and Gohan. We're all with you. What's he doing? What are you thinking? Ow. Why did you bring them all here now? Because it's all or nothing at this point. Plus, I've got a plan. And Ow. Everyone to pull it off. Dang it. Cheater! Don't blink, Kakarot. These will be your final moments before I crush you. Get there. Am I losing my mind? He turned into a giant monkey. This is crazy. How do I fight this? Black, black, black. Damn it! It was bad enough when Gohan turned into one of these hulking things, but this is a hundred times Good. worse. I finally figured it out. The monster that stomped my grandpa Gohan to death. Smashed up the tournament we'll get it all first. those years ago. That, that was me, wasn't it? I might as well let you know. The power level of a Saiyan when they transformed into a grade 8 is 10 times their normal strength. Crap! Just what I thought you couldn't get any more. Ow, he grabbed me. Don't give up, Goku. It might look hopeless, but we've survived this far. Krillin? Get up, get up, Goku. I'll, I'm not done yet. Not just me, bud. Yamcha and Chao Tzu and Gohan. We're all with you. Who dawa kama me? Krillin, what are you thinking? Why would you bring them all here now? I did mega damage. It's all or nothing at this point. Plus, I've got a plan, and I need everyone to pull it off. I'm behind you. Let's easy. Let's go. Okay, what's gonna happen? Now, all three of us need to hit him with a solar flare. This is pretty epic. Holy cow! Of your energy into this next attack! Damn 
Damn you! You won't get away! Oh, Chow Tzu! Oh, Chow! <laughs> He's been weakened enough that Chow Tzu's paralysis is working! Okay, this is our chance, guys! There's no way! We did it! Guys! We really did it! We actually managed to beat that guy, and we did it together! <laughs> yeah, we did, but I don't have much left in me after all that. <laughs> he put up a good fight, but we were more than prepared for him. <gasps> don't worry, Gohan. You were the worst enemy we ever faced. But I guess the least we can do is give you a burial. Who's burying who? Oh, dang. Uh -huh. Goku and his friends are certain of their victory. However, Vegeta survives their attack with sheer immensity of his life force. Goku and the others have used all of their energy in this life or death struggle. However, little it may be, it is only Piccolo and Goku who have remaining key. Drawing on their meager amount, they challenge Vegeta once again. Despite Vegeta's counterattacks, Goku manages to withstand them. Goku buys time with Piccolo's choosing the right moment to channel the remaining key into his fingertips. Namekian, what do you hope to do with such little? Mm -hmm. No way! Special beam cannon! Watch out, Goku! Vegeta nearly dodges Pickle's attack and frees himself from Goku's hold. Uh, uh, Goku! As a result, Goku takes the front brunt of Piccolo's special beam cannon and loses consciousness. When Goku becomes when Goku comes to, he sees Gohan cornered by Vegeta. Daddy! No! My son! And my friends! No! Get away! When his life is online, Goku finally punches. Goku's final punch collides with Vegeta. Vegeta takes full force of the punch and summons his spaceship in an attempt to return home. Krillin determines to d deter Vegeta from escaping, moves in for the finishing blow. But when the final, with his final breath, Goku stops Krillin, him. I'm begging you, just let him go. I know it, it's selfish, but I don't, I don't want him to die. With these final words, Goku takes his last breath. Choosing to honor Goku's final wishes, Krillin listens and allows Vegeta to escape. Bring Goku back to life with the Dragon Balls. And the next time we meet, you're going down for good! Krillin's final words will soon invite not only Vegeta, but even the more terrifying enemies to attack Earth. However, no one can foresee that yet. As for Goku, after his death in the battle with Vegeta, Kami arranges him to train under the watchful gaze of King Kai. Goku has grown stronger by training with his companions and battling other Saiyans. He arrives before, he arrives before King Kai within mere days, meanwhile back on Earth. Concerned by Vegeta's use of the worst Namekian, Piccolo decides to travel to planet Namek on a spaceship that was once used by Kami. Kuan wishes to become as strong as possible before the Saiyans attack Earth again. Ignores Chi Chi's and decides to travel with Piccolo to train under, under him. Nearly one month later, Goku surprises King Kai by quickly mastering Kyo Cannon's Spirit Bomb. However, King Kai soon notices that Vegeta is once again on the course for Earth. Goku rushes to notify his friends that they need to revive him with the Dragon Balls. He is then back on Earth within a few hours. Goku and his companions then travel to the site where Vegeta's key is and they prepare for battle. Vegeta! I didn't expect to face you again so soon. Kakarot, if you've been revived, that means the Dragon Balls really do live up to the rumors. That's good. Listen up, all of you. If you don't want to die, you need to let me use these Dragon Balls to become immortal. <coughs> if you don't believe me, believe this. The Dragon Balls are being sought after by Frieza, the self-proclaimed Emperor of the Universe. F Frieza? And I can assure you, not a single Earthling could ever match his power. 
Breeze is considered absolutely invincible. But if I'm granted immortality, I can kill him and spare all your lives. So if you know what's good for you, hand over the Dragon Balls. You, you've got to be kidding me. After what you did to Goku, why would we ever let you make a wish on the Dragon Balls? Yeah, no offense, but I find it hard to believe there's anyone who could be stronger than Goku anyway. Vegeta, even if you're telling the truth, I'm still not going to let you use the Dragon Balls. And besides, the Earth is ours to defend. <laughs> Fine, then I'll just have to take them by force. All right. Saying it's like a little longer? Question mark? Okay, could you leave this one to me? You got it. We're counting on you, Goku. All right, Vegeta, check this out. You know I can do this? Take this. Ah. Vegeta, I can tell you've gotten even stronger than last time. Am I right? Naturally. You see, every time Saiyans recover from the brink of death, they grow more and more powerful. So don't even think this is going to go the same way as last time. <laughs> I'm not dumb enough to underestimate you like that. If anything, I was going to say the exact same thing to you. Silence. I'm no ordinary Saiyan. I'm the prince of all Saiyans. Leagues upon leagues ahead of you. All right, Vegeta, now I have a big spear bomb. Oh no! Goku, get up! How can this be? How can Kakarot outpass me? It's infuriating. What could be to my advantage? What's it? No, only spirit bomb on him. Kakarot, what would you say to forming a temporary alliance with me to defeat Frieza? An alliance? It will still take some time before Frieza arrives on your planet. If the two of us train until then, we might be able to take him down together. Hold on. If this Frieza person is aiming to attack Earth, then how did you manage to get here before him? Frieza travels in a gargantuan mothership, so my more compact space pod allow me to land here much quicker. None of this changes the fact that we can't trust you. Guys, I think Vegeta's actually telling us the truth. I don't think he'd ever sacrifice his pride as a Saiyan warrior to lie about somebody being stronger than him. I don't know, just doesn't make sense to me. If anything, I think he'd much sooner die trying to steal the Dragon Balls than sacrifice his pride. Th then there really is someone stronger than you and Vegeta? And they want to conquer Earth? I believe you. And I think we have no other choice but to join forces. Let's go. That's awesome. Well, what is this? With that, Goku and his companions begin cooperating with Vegeta to confront Frieza, Emperor of the Universe, who is on his way to attack Earth. While Goku and Vegeta begin training, Bulma and the others are tasked with keeping in contact with Piccolo and Gohan as they travel to Planet Namek. Goku and Vegeta train together refining their combat skills using a gravity chamber developed by Bulma's father. One day, the team decides Frieza, sorry, the team def detects Frieza's key approaching Earth and realizes that the moment has finally come. Due to the massive size of that key, Tien decides to leave Chatsu behind, while Goku and his friends travel to Frieza's expecting landing point. They are attacked during their travels by Vegeta's former rival, Kui, but Vegeta has grown stronger from training and defeats him easily. So... Which one of you wants to die next? Don't start getting a swollen head just because you beat Queen, Vegeta! Dodoria and Zarbon! I might have known you'd show your sorry faces. You're even more foolish than I thought, Vegeta. Did you think teaming up with these Earthlings would put you on equal footing with Frieza? <laughs> then you're as foolish as I thought if you think I'd be relying on Earthlings. Wait. I recall Lord Frieza saying something about a Saiyan survivor that had been sent to the distant blue planet, Earth. A Saiyan who was raised on Earth? 
that be me? <laughs> a couple of monkeys flocking together. If the Saiyan race couldn't survive a little meteor, what makes you think you could survive against us? <laughs> Let's just make the last two idiots go extinct. Easy to that. Not even a challenge. Okay. I'm going to stop here, guys. But next time we'll... I'll do. I'll continue this series. Uh, this is so awesome. Good. It's like really cool to see this, this new story, and uh, I'm really excited to see what's next. But I love you guys. Stay powerful and bye.